In a bid to support the livelihood of residents of Agboike to LCDA, the lawmaker representing Kushofe Constituency 2, Femi Sahid, embarked on an empowerment scheme aimed at giving back to the society. The program, which held at Agboike to Shopping Arcade, witnessed the presence of political leaders, lawmakers, traditional rulers, council chairmen, students, as well as residents. Speaking at the program, Femi Sahid assured these people of quality representation and he said he will continue to facilitate programs that will support their livelihood. He appreciated them for their support since the commencement of his tenure. Today, I feel what I'm giving you here. My, pro uh, my proposition at the later stage was to do 250. But later, when I fought the law, my people, you know, my people, have, I increased it to 500. For 500, we have to increase it to 561. All of you will have your cash grant. It is not empowerment. My people, these are what I have done on your behalf. These are what sent me to go and represent you. And I think in my own way, I have tried to the best of my ability. The highlight of the event was presentation of cash grants to 500 beneficiaries, donation of waste to wealth beans, presentation of bursaries to deserving indigent students, donation and refurbishment of six boreholes, presentation of two school buses to the Kosofe constituency to students. This man, Honorable Said, is a very resourceful human being, lawmaker, he is intelligent and brilliant. You know, it is not a joke for a new member to rise on the floor of the house as they have said and made contribution, not just contribution, you know, positive and intelligent contribution to all issues. I commend you. And that is why we will stay out of assembly, special among other houses of assembly. And I stand as they have mentioned that above common standard of he is one of the most educa educationally inclined legislators in the State House of Assembly. I know how passionate he is when it comes to the issue of education. He will call me from time to time to seek for one form of admission or the other for one constituent or another. So we must continue to appreciate and commend legislators like this that have uh, interests of his constituents at heart. Honorable Femi Said. The honorable member representing constituencies two, Ikosishiri and Agboi Ketu in uh, Lagos State House of Assembly has been doing wonderfully well since uh, a year ago that he was elected to represent us. He has done programs like this. Uh, if I don't mistake, maybe this will be the third time. Uh, in most places, they will say the representative in the legislative area is to make laws but we don't forget that any legacy you leave behind is what people will think about so i'm really very happy that he thinks of the people he thinks that he has to go back to them on a dividend for democracy and i really congratulate him for that he, he has provided school bus for the and Agweke to lcda and is giving out over 500 support over 500 residents of Agweke to in terms of financial uh, gifts um, coming up with bottles and a lot of programs like that and he has done a lot a lot of things that he has been doing before now he has been supporting uh, the needs of our communities so we, we all appreciate it honorable famous said is a uh, an amiable, wonderful, indefatigable uh, representative of uh, Kosovo Council 22. And uh, we are very happy to be identified with him. We are here today because he's you know, giving back to the society, appreciating the people that sent him. The Speaker House of Assembly, Right Honorable Mudashiri Obasa, initiated stakeholders' meeting, which is a yearly program. 
And through that yearly quarterly meeting, we meet, we share the ideas, we, do, we contribute, and their feedback is taken back to the floor of the house. And that is the reflection of what we are seeing here today. Because I've done a rendition of one year that I've been in their house representing these people. What they've exactly asked me to go and do in terms of representation, it's what you see me reading out. The empowerment scheme will go a long way in impacting the lives of our boy students. Go sharing. Go being